Hello, this is Stephanie Chow, and I am your District 4 Director. Whether you're a brand new Toastmaster or an existing member looking to switch from the Legacy Education Program to Pathways, sometimes the hardest part about getting started is, well, knowing where to start. That's why I have recorded this short video to show you how to pick your path and how to launch your icebreaker. There are many other features of Pathways to Learn, but that'll come in due time. Just start with the basics and take it from there. First, go to toastmasters.org in any internet browser. Click login at the top of the screen. Type in your member ID or email and your password. If you don't know your password, either click the forgot password link towards the bottom of the screen or contact Toastmasters International directly. Once you're logged in, you'll focus on this drop down menu that says Pathways. There are several different options here, many of which will take you to the same screen. If you click Take the Assessment, this assessment will ask you several questions that will recommend several paths for you. You're welcome to take that. I would recommend taking the assessment anyways. You can either pick one of the recommended paths or you can choose a different one. If you want to learn more about the paths, you can go to Pathways and learn more. Scroll down and you can click on any of these paths and read more about them. Let's say you have already picked your path. You can log into Basecamp, which is the main center where you will access your speech modules and track your progress. In this middle panel here, it'll say access my path through Basecamp. Select the home club that you would like to visit. If you have multiple ones, it will end up here. And then click login as a member. Lots of things to see here, lots of things to click on. When you have the time and patience, I suggest that you click around and explore. But for the purposes of this video, let's look at how to visit a path, open that up, and launch your icebreaker. When you scroll down, you'll come to a section that says My Education Transcript. If you have several paths going at once, which you can do, you'll see them listed here. You'll see a few other things here listed on my base camp that will likely not apply to you, but you can take note of them anyways. My very first path, the one that the assessment recommended to me, was called Effective Coaching. What I'll want to do now is click Open Curriculum. You'll see here that I am now on level four of Effective Coaching. These levels have been checked off as I've completed them and you'll see the percentage of progress right here in this circle. Where you'll start is by clicking on level one. You'll see this icebreaker here that's been marked as complete. If you've never logged in before, of course, it will say nothing. It'll have instead an, a button here that says activate. Once you activate a project, you can click it again to launch. So this may launch in a separate screen. It may appear as a pop-up. You can click through the modules. I won't go through an example now because once it pops up, you'll be able to click through it on your own. And towards the end of that education module, you'll be able to download the evaluation resource and print it out to give to your evaluator in your in-person Toastmasters meeting to fill out. Once your speech is complete, you can come back here into Basecamp, launch this again, and close out the end of the project. The system will ask you to rate the skills that you've learned compared to where you were when you first started. And once you exit out of that, the checkbox will appear here, and you'll continue on your journey. That's a simple overview just to complete your icebreaker. If you have questions beyond that or anything more specific, please contact your Vice President of Education or you can email quality at d4tm.org. 
So stay tuned for more and I hope you enjoyed this video.